Days. It's Extreme Makeover Home Edition. Tonight. It's the Powell family. Now, this is an exceptional family. One loving family. Keenan, the youngest, is sick. He is highly allergic to mold. Feels like I'm drowning. I can't breathe. But these guys are living in a house that is literally bad for his health. It could possibly kill him. You can breathe, right? Yeah, I'm all right. But for a second there, you couldn't. Yeah. You should not even be living in this house right now, is what I'm being told. It's still out of here. It's contaminated. They're about to receive the surprise renovation of their dreams. The Extreme Makeover Design Team has only seven days to rip down and rebuild absolutely everything. Oh, yeah, she's down. One house. Move, move. One week. One Extreme Makeover. <laughs> the Home Edition. That's what I'm talking about. starts right now. Okay, guys. Allie, Dawson, Paige, Michael. Let me tell you about the next family. It's the Powell family. All right? Mom, Carrie, and her two sons, Christopher and Keenan. Now, this is an exceptional family who's had some unfortunate circumstances happen to them. Check out this tape they sent us, and you'll see what I'm talking about. Hi, ABC. We're the Powell family, and I'm Carrie. I'm Chris. And I'm Keenan. And... We need an extreme makeover on our home. Keenan, the youngest, is 16 and a basketball hero. He's, he's won awards all around the world. This is my room. All my trophies that I've won. But what you would never guess by looking at Keenan is that he's, he's sick. When I was young, I was diagnosed with a cell disease called mastocytosis and only was really given a year to live. And for us to think that he would never make it, was just really heartbreaking. Seems like we were at Children's Hospital every day. He also has chronic allergies and asthma, and he is highly allergic to mold. We found that uh, the house is riddled with mold. And every time they try and get rid of it, it just keeps coming back. We've got toxic mold. You don't want to be around it. You don't want to be breathing it in. It causes major allergy attacks. There we have up here the mold. Okay. Their house has mold, the bad kind. Nobody should have to live in a house filled with mold. Mold everywhere. It causes brain damage. It can kill you. Oh. He's living in the room with the mold. So we've got to have to get in there, see what's going on with the mold, see the damage, figure out what we can do, get it out of there, and then give them a house they truly deserve. We're on our way. we got to scold the mold. That's the house right up there. Wow. So wow. what do you say? Okay, we, need to, we go we give need them to... a little wake-up call. What yeah. do you say? Yeah. Let's, Let's go! go! Let's go, guys. Let's go. Good morning, Powell family! Carrie, Christopher, and Keenan, wake up and come on out of here! Come on out of here! Hey! Oh, no. All right! Thank you so much! <laughs> so here's what's gonna happen. You guys are going to New York City for a week. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. And while you're gone, we're going to take care of that house, and there's a lot to take care of. So we don't have a lot of time. Here's what's going to happen. You need to take me to the house, show me the house, pack your stuff, and we need to get you out of here, OK? okay. Design team, the clock starts now. We have a week. Take a look around. Guys, show me the house. Do you want to see it? Are you ready? I'm ready. Oh, no. Is that the mold? That's the mold. Oh. But these guys are living in a house that is literally bad for his health. It could possibly kill him. You can breathe, right? Yeah, I'm all right. But for a second there, you couldn't. Yeah, for a second I couldn't. Probably because I peeled back that paper. Yeah. We won't do that again while we're here, uh, okay? Okay, thank so, you. So, uh, let's go check out your room. Okay. Dude, you're pretty good. Yeah, I'm actually pretty good. <laughs> I gotta give you another one. Thank you. <laughs> if you start having a reaction, what, what happens? It feels like I'm drowning. I can't breathe. It, my lungs collapse. I, it just it's really hurts. It's hard for me to even breathe in my room, my own room. Yeah. Um, we have mold growing right here. And of course, what, in it's there. in the ceiling? It's in the ceiling. It's uh, up there. It's everywhere. Oh. That's where that mold is. That right there is what's making Keenan sick. And that right there must go. 
Here's the problem. They've tried to get rid of it. They've tried to clean it, use bleats, that kind of a thing, but the mold keeps coming back. Is there an area in the house that he can go to that he can breathe safely? The driveway. The driveway. How many times has, has Keenan been in the hospital? Over 20 times. Twice really? in intensive care. What kind of hospital bills are you? We lost a car behind the hospital bills. Really? Yeah. When I was first born, they said, well, they said they only gave me a year to live. Wait, they only gave you a They only gave me a year to live. And once past that year, they said I would never be able to play sports, never be able to do anything like a normal kid would do. And of course, now... You've proven them quite I've wrong. I've proven them a lot wrong. I'll get you, my pretty. The whole kitchen? Not gonna happen. I'm gonna have to blow this thing up and start over. And what is that? That's a nice leg. This is a square grand piano. Are you kidding? It's about 160 years old. Wow. Can you put this back together? I'll see what I can do. Nice. Christopher is currently living in the living room on a couch that doesn't even fit him. Can you tell me why you're living out in the living room? Is there not a room for you or something? Well, I have it's a room, room but You can't get a bed in it. Yeah. Why is that? Because of the way the hallway is. So this is more like a... A storage room. Yes. I understand you also want to be a, a barber, is that right? Yeah, actually, I'm planning on going to barber school and going ahead and getting my license and hopefully have my own shop one day. Right on. Yeah. Oh, paint job. Ooh, 80s called. They need their paint job back. This bathroom is tiny, tiny, tiny. These boys are big, big, big. I'm looking at that bathtub, and I can tell right now that I know you don't fit in that thing, and I know you barely do. Now, this is your bedroom. Yes. This is this, the master this bedroom. This is the master Sweet. Now, Christopher spent a lot of time traveling with the Navy, Navy yes. and uh, you've done some traveling as well, correct? When I was very young, we moved to Morocco and Northern Africa. Morocco? Oh, Morocco is like a step back in time. You know, the men are still traveling on the camels, and they've got all the tents and the tapestries, and then the wonderful aromas. You ever miss some of that? Yes. This is great! This is great! This is great? Finally, we don't have a room that we have to do anything to. Put the door back down. I can't take it. Do you think this family needs my help? <laughs> I think so. You probably spend a lot of time here, huh? This is where I spend most of my time. I love being back here. So you're a pretty serious gardener. Yes. I mean, you're like a professional. Yes. When Keenan was diagnosed with this illness, I had to stop working. I had to figure out a way to be here for him. So I started a floral business. All I can say is the bar is set very high. <laughs> For uh, my gardening friend Dawson. I want to give her the Mac Daddy of all gardens. You guys ready to go to New York City? Absolutely. So all I need is the keys. Uh, you guys go on vacation and we'll try and figure out what to do with that mold. Cool. All right? All right. So you guys have a blast in the Big Apple. And that, I mean, it's poisonous. It can yeah. kill you. Can we get in there and get rid yeah, of this Yeah, you, you can. It's just, it's extensive. It. Yeah, to bait it is really extensive. We only have seven days. I mean, I see that she likes color. I see that she likes an ethnic thing. Yes, she, she lives she in Morocco really for 10 years. So why not just go uh, crazy and we give her the full-on Moroccan villa? Okay. Uh, so get your passport, kids. We're going to Morocco. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. You know what, guys? The Moroccan theme's fantastic. I think the second thing that's going to blow their minds is giving them more space. They I mean, definitely need where more Where we're space. sitting right now is the perfect place for it. Yeah, there's so, already a pad here. You're right. Pad, this family needs this. an addition. Second thing that we're going to add is a master bedroom and bathroom. And that master bedroom looks right out onto her beautiful garden, her lush garden. Oh. You guys are going to create the garage. They don't use it. It's they fill it to the brim okay. with yeah. crap. So yeah. wrap your fingers around this one. To give them a basketball court in the garage. An indoor basketball court. Indoor board. basketball oh, court. I would love in it. In the garage. It's a little short. Hardwood we floors. To, we we have pop to the ceiling up. up. All right, so hey, Hi. man, I'm Ty. Hey, Ty, how you doing? Tom Blakely. I'm with uh, American Mold Guard. American Mold Guard. So you guys are the... You guys the can get rid of mold, yep. and you get rid of mold. Yep. Because we got some mold. You got yellow, green, and black, uh, which suggests that it uh, could be uh, Aspergillus, Penicillium, and uh, possibly Stachybotrys. But what's the deal? We shouldn't even be in there? We shouldn't be breathing that? Technically, until we find out what's going on there, no. Really. Well, I got people Just in the house the right now. Just for the health safety of everyone. Do yeah. I need to get everybody out until we figure it out? Yeah. Hello? Hey, Carrie, it's me, Ty. How are you? Hi, Ty. How are you? Well, I'm good, but... I don't think you realize the severity of what you're living in 
Now, I know you guys saw some mold, but from what I'm hearing from Tom and all his equipment he's got here, you should not even be living in this house right now, is what I'm being told. Oh. We will do what we can to eradicate the situation and make a better living space for uh, you and your family, okay? Okay, I'm putting my trust in you. All right, bye. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. How'd it go? Well, it's not good. Seriously, these guys are going to have to come in and literally quarantine the house. We're going to have to mask off every room that's got severe damage, rip out all the mold, then test it to make sure that all the mold's gone before we can even get started on this thing. We'd like to put about 550 feet out here, right where we're standing right now. Well, well the good news is, is that's outside. Maybe we could get started on that. Okay. And yep. we'll lose this, scrap this right here, and give uh, them a great room, yeah, a mom, a new master bedroom and bath. It's a great idea. Um, that sounds good. Um, Keenan's room. Here. I'll take care of that. Okay. Oh, good. You got Keenan's okay. room. Now, because we do have so much work to do in seven days, we're already got a setback because of the mold. Let's jump on anything we can do immediately, Absolutely. get it out of the way, Absolutely. so that we can try and catch up once they get out of here. Yeah, okay? Well. Are we that ready to do good. this? We yeah. are. Yeah. 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 Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Hello, Hello Power Family. family. How, How are, are you? you? It's, it's me, me Ty. Ty. Oh, my God. If you hang on, I'm going to let Paige know it's time for something we like to call <laughs> demolition. <laughs> Paige, I've just, just got, got the results. results. We, we are, are a green, green light. light. Go for demo. We got the news, guys. Yeah. 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 Oh, my God. Let's do it. You guys are ready to tear this sucker apart? But noise! Oh my god! I gotta go save a piano! Alright! Here! Go, go! Go, go! Look at my beautiful Wisteria! Carrie, we're saving your plant. Some, Some of the, the good, good ones, ones okay? okay? Some of the bad ones are going. Oh yeah! She's down! No! Keaton, yeah. I have to tell you, I was never a fan of the yellow paint! Oh, hey, hey! Oh, hey, you're <laughs> Enjoy the apple. So my room getting demolished. They mad. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm glad to know that you know I'm coming back to a whole new house. You see how they yeah. trashed my house? Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Hello. Woo! Great job, but we gotta save this piano. When I saw the piano on its side in the kitchen being used as countertop space. I found out from the neighbor, it's an old piano. It's from the 1850s. The family bought it a little while ago and wanted to restore it, but didn't have the money to properly restore it. So we're going to do that for them. See all this detail? That means we're actually going to get in there, sand it all, and just bring it back to its original luster. I may have bitten off more than I can chew with this thing. We're going to take this to the front and save it. I'm really confident that what we saved, we're going to be able to put back in the ground, and it's going to flourish. Of course, we can't save everything. Clear! <laughs> the plants right now are stressed. They're in shock. Clear! Some of them might bite the dust, but most of them are going to survive. She make it. Coming up. So we're about to eradicate the last bit of mold in your house. We're gonna eradicate the mold. Oh God, there it is! What's going on? I'm going in! That's next on Extreme Makeover, the home edition. I've got this guy coming in who does this amazing, it's called Venetian plaster. And they put the plaster on and get it real smooth and they put the pigment in it. Moroccan design is about color. It's about being graphic and bold and colorful. The master bathroom is going cobalt blue, and that's going to be the Venetian plaster. I'm going to go with that beautiful, deep cobalt blue and a theme of blues that will really transport them to another place. What are you thinking for glaze? Basically the same color, just so it gets some movement. So I, I think, think that's think everything. Done. Right Full on. house, check. It's really hard to tear plants out of somebody's place that you know they've loved and cared for. But I knew that we couldn't save all of them. Dawson, he's really got a challenge on his hands. He's going to have to come up with a landscape plan that's going to dazzle a woman who knows her vegetation. She's a horticulturist. She knows plants. This garden was really difficult for a couple of reasons. I wanted to make sure that she had a great herb garden, and also things that wouldn't hurt her son with his allergies. Hello? Has anybody seen a blue sock? This right here actually kills mold. The pals have a mold problem. This will kill mold and bacteria, and it's in black, so it's going to look really beautiful. Definitely be able to play some ball in this room. We had to go up 16 feet. This created a rather large box sitting out in the middle of the street. It sort of has a thickness to it. It became grossly apparent that something had to be done to make this look a little bit more attractive. As it is right now, it's a lot of nothing like that. Check 
out the house. Wow, a lot more open. It's a brand new living room, all the big windows, the big kitchen. Oh, this is where her tub is going. This will be so nice for mom. You know, normally you wouldn't just see drywall without the tape and the mud going on. We'd be a lot further, but we had our mold situation. We lost a day. The Moroccan theme is complicated. I have to question whether or not we should have done a Moroccan theme and have a day down for the mold. This pile of debris, not really part of mom's lush gardens. This is actually really nice. Mom is going to love this. This gives me hope that this backyard will be done, but right now, that scares me. So I'm about to call the Powell family and let them know what's going on with their house. OK. Hello? Hey, Carrie, it's Ty. How are you? Hi, Ty. So we're about to eradicate the last bit of mold in your house, and I wanted you guys to be a part of it. He's going to eradicate the mold. Well, hang on, because this is about to get pretty dicey, all right? OK. Oh, God, there it is. I'm going in. I'm going to put you down for a second. Hang on. What's going on? I'm going in. Hey. Oh, my oh, God. OK. I'm on it. You got it? OK, guys. I got one last bit. Thank you, Ty. You got it, Carrie. Have fun. Bye. He said he got rid of the last bit of mold. Hey, Allie. You want a grilled cheese sandwich? I think I solved another problem. This last night was scaring all of us. We'll put three boxes right flat on the top of the building, and we're going to yeah. tile the inside tile the inside. Blue. against the terracotta. It's going to be awesome. That's fantastic. I like that. One last thing to think about. Michael's idea turned out to be really easy. I just fashioned some two by fours together, threw it up there. Just kind of break up the monotony of this huge wall. It will just sell that Moroccan theme as soon as you walk up to the house. What do you think? Break it up a little, huh? Just ahead. Let's have a meeting. Our mission's going to be lost unless we can get in there and get what needs to get done, which is a lot. I've got a huge list here. It's freaking me out how far behind we are. That's ahead. This house is going to be awesome. This is going all wrong. This is absolutely His and her friends part of My Relationships Friday at 10. New to UK TV style. I have to say, this could be the most stylish house we've ever done. It's going to be a rockin' Moroccan house. The keyhole entry. This actually looks really, really cool. This is going to look beautiful. Tie right into that front entry. This house is going to be awesome. This basketball court is amazing. Go team! Maybe we could be two on two. The house had fallen behind schedule, and we were really bugging. <laughs> contractor and I thought let's just get out of their way there's a park across the street I grabbed the basketball I grabbed the other designers I'm like let's have a little game under no circumstance can we let them win seriously okay all right Michael from 20 get him Allie Allie in my face <laughs> what two nothing don't bring that in here no four nothing I think Michael was cheating he probably took some <laughs> pointers from Keenan because he was actually going to the hoop pretty well yeah six nothing I wasn't really ready Nice. I wasn't ready. Taking some you know what. That's right. I, <laughs> and Paige was elbowing. That, wait a minute. You're oh, holding me. And I had my construction boots on. I was also tired. The sun was in my eyes. <laughs> Dawson was on my team. Whoa! He speaks Latin. Oh no! Well, basketball isn't Latin. We could really use Keenan. I know. <laughs> Thank you. Game! Yes! <laughs> Alright, back to work? Back, back to, to work. work. This is Extreme Makeover's quickest before and after shot you'll ever see. You ready? Before. Yeah. After. Nice. Now, if we can make that look like that, we're going to be OK. But we don't have a lot of time, and things are starting to get darn ugly. Yeah. As you can see, we still haven't got the stucco up on this side of the house. Luckily, we got it up on that side. Day five, 
We're in the master bedroom. We've got two doors that'll go out to the garden. Very nice. Got a curved wall that we fought so hard to actually make happen. Thank God that's in. But here's what's not in, but it is going to be very cool. We're going to have an infinity bath and a shower. The water's actually going to come down from here. We're going to be able to recycle. Same with an infinity sink. This is a whole new living area that we've added to the house that literally has opened up the house in a big way. Amazing. Look at the room. Now I've spent all the way to the kitchen, all the way to the end of the yard, and out to the garden. I think you get the idea. We've already done amazing things. The question is, can we do it in time? I know this is normally Ty's thing, but this is going to be really funny. I want to have some fun with Christopher. You know, he wants to be a barber. Hello, Christopher. I hope you're having a good time. Paige and I have a little surprise for you. This is your new room. We've given you the ultimate, check it out, barbershop bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> We've got everything right over here. All the supplies over here. The beautiful sink. Oh. This amazing barber chair. And we know how much that you love your sofa slash bed. So <laughs> we've taken the liberty to save that for you. I like the couch thing. Too. <laughs> I was worried about having to you know, try to adjust to a bed, but the couch is cool. Paige, take a little off the back for me, would you? We'll see you later. Have okay. fun in New York. Bye-bye. Enjoy. Oh, it's cool. You know, then I could charge people a grip of money to see on my off days. You know, and, you know cut them at the house. So. We got it. We got it. <laughs> Very nice. Excellent. Now let's really do something. No, 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 let's not. No. I'm putting this chock full of plants that she can love. Tons Fantastic. of different Fantastic. varieties than she ever, ever dreamed of. Well, I love the desert scape, the oasis up front. I love the big pond in the back. That sounds amazing. Do me a favor, uh, show the rest of the design team uh, the plan. I'm sure they're going to be as impressed as I am. I've got to get back to work. We've got so much to do, but it looks fantastic. Great job. Stay here. Don't follow me. Sorry, guys. Can't see this. Please, give me some privacy, thanks. Coming up. All right, the Harlem Globetrotters. Those guys were really awesome. They helped us out with plumbing, planning, dusting. They even did a little decorating while they were there. That's next on Extreme Makeover, the home edition. It's day six, which means the family comes home tomorrow. Does anybody feel like we're a little behind schedule? Is it just me? We're about a day behind. This mold has really created nothing but a huge delay. Everybody, cross your fingers. God, I don't know what to say. It's not looking good. 24 hours to go! I certainly hope that's the right color! Paige, guess what? We've only got 24 hours till the family comes home. Can you register that? It's only 24 yes. hours till the family comes home. Don't worry, the house is gonna get done in time. I just want to say one thing to you. Okay? Yeah. You've done a fantastic job. So far. Well, we've only got 24 hours and the family comes home. I couldn't put one plant in the ground because I knew they'd get ruined. It's honestly, I don't see how you're going to pull this off in 24 hours. Does that mean keep working? Yes. I hope so. Let's keep making that sign. Yeah. Keep doing that. Yeah, yeah. In a couple hours, this will look completely different. Than I certainly hope so. I'm getting the feeling Dawson's kind of out there on his own, on a limb. So you've got trees to install. Huge trees. Huge trees. So that's a big installation. You've, yeah. got, you've got some guys to help you with that. There's not one plant on the ground, and I have hundreds of plants to plant. To be honest with you, he's not going to be able to do it alone. He needs the team, and he needs, he needs a little help. All I know is I'm going to be here all night doing okay. it, OK? But can you promise me that it'll be done by the time the family gets home tomorrow? Oh. Scott's you honor. Thank you've got, you. You've got your work cut out, Thank my friend. You. Oh, did somebody say Morocco? Hello. This right here is the picture from the dining room table. Twelve hours and the family comes home. Twelve hours. Hey, Paige. Sweetie, we've only got twelve hours. Let's step it up a notch. I'm on it. One way or another, we're going to make it happen. I just got a shovel and just started digging. Damage any more of the leaves. Great, great, great. great. When the sun comes up, that yard's going to be planted by hook or crook. Things have turned out better than I dreamed. I guess planting by moonlight is really good. 
Sometimes people ask me, does this really happen in seven days? Yes, this really happens in seven days. We need this in the house, like now. Here we go. Feel like a Pied Piper. All right, we're about to move the piano back in. It's been refinished. The only problem is it weighs about 2,000 pounds. All right, into the house. Moving pianos is really easy. If I could bite my nails, I would right now. I'll bite your nails. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. Woo! Just like that, baby. That right there goes gently. In. Here we go. Gently. This table needs to be tight. Table. Whoa. Back to work. I love my job. What can I tell you? I get to have fun with the family, but I also get to call in some favors from friends and make some things happen. The Harlem Globetrotters showed up. I couldn't believe it. They're awesome. All right. The Harlem Globetrotters. Well, Thanks for coming. This family's gonna freak out when they see you guys. I can use your help in more ways than just one. If you follow me, we're gonna actually put you guys to work. Thanks a lot. And those guys were really awesome. They helped us out to finish the house in, in the wee, wee minutes before the family got home. The guys helped us out like with plumbing, with planning, with dusting. Hey, Emma, do you need some high? Yeah. All right. They even did a little uh, interior decorating while they were there. They were really tall. They're really athletic, and they're not bad with fluff and pillows. <laughs> Up next. Here they come! <laughs> Welcome home, Pillow Family! Are you guys ready to see your new house? Yes. yes. Bus driver! <laughs> That's next on Extreme Makeover, the home edition. My dear for a program, uh, arm wrestling with Chaz and Dave. Never go in and... Friday night... On UK TV Gold. So many people in the neighborhood who we love and who love us. Welcome home, Pillow Family! How are ya? What's up, Nadina? I'm really excited. It was really emotional. I felt like a lot of people cared for me and wanted to see me get better. They all wanted to be there for my great experience with me. Are you guys ready to see your new house? Yes. yes. Yeah? Yes. Are you really ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here we go. Yeah. Bus driver! Incredible. This reminds me of my childhood. Well, let's hope so. Oh, if you like the outside, wait till you see the inside. Oh, Through that door is a whole new beginning. Oh my God! Oh, my God. Look at! Oh my God! Look at this! Wow. Oh my God! Oh, this is incredible. Incredible. This can't be for us. Oh, man. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> when we saw the kitchen, it blew all of us away. This is my house? Oh, man. I couldn't believe that that was for me. 
It was so incredible. So you finally got a dining room table big enough for everybody. But beyond that, we added an extra 400 square feet and gave you a great oh room. Oh, my God. But I think the most amazing thing we did is we got rid of the mold so that Keenan and the rest of the family can literally breathe in their own home. Keenan, go ahead. Breathe in for me because, that's right, the mold is completely no. gone. I didn't smell any dust, any mold, any dander, nothing. It was just all clean air. Okay, so check out your new great room. So you've got all new furniture, all new entertainment center, <gasps> new Persian rugs that Michael actually picked out at Sears. Oh Amazing stuff. God. But here's a key thing that you guys might not realize. What's sitting over there is actually your piano. Oh, oh my God! Oh my God! This is just too incredible for words. I know you spent a lot of time in Morocco, so we knew we wanted to bring those design elements into the house. Oh, you, you hit it just right. This is so amazing. It was like they picked my brain and knew exactly what I wanted, and they just went above and beyond that. Now, Christopher, you used to actually sleep on the couch. Right. Check out your new room, buddy. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I had to go jump in it. It's much better than jumping on the couch. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, look at this! Check this out, a real barbershop chair. And I'm like, dude, you know, take a little off the top. Can you lower my ears for me? And uh, and he was just about to do it. And I'm like, you're not gonna turn that on, are <laughs> So guys, we're gonna check out your new bathroom. Oh, oh my god! Oh man, oh man, this is great. So is everybody enjoying the tour so far? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. fun to be the guy that's standing in the house that says, listen, I'm going to stay here, but I want you to go check out your room. Oh. Oh, my God, I'm a goddess. Look at this. Oh, my God. This is so incredible. Oh, this is... Oh! It's so rewarding to see, you know, someone who truly deserves it, like get literally the bedroom of their dreams. You guys oh aren't God. gonna believe this. Look at this. I'm an empress. I'm a goddess. Oh, 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 oh yeah. <laughs> this is this incredible. Is... Come here, Mom. <gasps> okay, Carrie. Oh, we gave you the I ultimate Morocco bedroom. Oh my God. It was incredible. Oh Wanting to cry but it was a happy cry. Check this out. This is called an infinity tub. So this actually, the water comes right out of the sea. Oh my God! Oh my God! Look at that! Oh, this is the most amazing okay. thing I have ever seen in my life. I just can't believe this. This is your beautiful oasis that you can make your bath oils, light your incense, your candles, and totally chill out and relax. I've got a whole new life now to go to. I might even start dating again. <laughs> Would you guys like to see the backyard? Yes. yes. Go check out your garden. Oh my God. Oh my God, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Look. look at this, my herb garden. Oh, my gardening shed. Oh, look at this. Look at this. I love my mom. Since day one, she worked hard, quit her job just to get me better. And to see her happiness, it meant everything to me. As you can Thank see, you. we added a wonderful rock water feature that actually has live koi in it. It's a koi pond. You're kidding. Oh, my God. I got my koi. I got my koi. <laughs> and also in here, this is a lush garden, an organic garden that's wow. literally going to grow. In a year, you won't be able to see any of the ground. It's going to overtake everything. Oh. It's incredible. It's incredible. Just ahead. Let's go back inside the house and check out a room that I've been working on all week. That would be Keenan's room. Oh my god! That's next on Extreme Makeover, the home edition. Keenan, 
I've been working on a room all week. You're going to be the first person to see it. I want you to go check out your new bedroom. It's the first door on the right down the hallway. He's a special kid who's had lots of struggles his whole life, so I went to Extra Links trying to make his dreams come true. Oh, my God! Oh, my God! Oh, my God! As soon as I saw the lockers, I was like, this is the room. This is my basketball room, what I always wanted. You gotta be killed. I was really excited. It was really emotional. I can't even describe it. Anything I could say, it's an understatement. Seen that happen before in my life. Yeah. Look it, look it, my autographed. Oh, oh, oh my God! Stop playing! Stop playing! Oh, oh man! Look, look at look that! It. Just to think about how much he'd been through and how much he deserved that. That was like the highlight of it. What do you think, man? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you like it? It was the greatest thing ever. It was the greatest thing in my life. Oh, it's cleanable. Because oh. I know you're allergic to a lot of stuff like dust and all that other stuff, so every surface area can be clean. It's good to know that from this moment on that he'll be able to breathe easy in the house. It's a beautiful thing. This is better than winning the lotto. This is a lot better, way better than winning the lotto. So you like your room? I love my room. And I go, well, guess what? It gets better. What's okay. this? I think we literally made a couple of dreams come true for, for everybody in that family. Oh, <laughs> oh, man. Look, look, look oh. at the scoreboard. <laughs> I think the family probably already had thought they died and went to heaven. And then the garage door rolls up. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, the Harlem Globe. Oh oh I thought, oh, what a moment for my kids. What an incredible moment. I was amazed. I didn't know you guys worked this kind of magic. You know, it was really special. Oh, oh yeah. Keenan, yeah. I think these guys can show you a few moves, man. Oh. I can't even put into words how thankful I am to ABC. Yeah. <laughs> it's a brand new house, a brand new start. Makes you a brand new person. We received a miracle from all of you. And I just want to say thank you. Thank you for helping my son. And thank you for giving us our lives back. I will always be grateful for what you've done for our family. And if you come in my face again, that's why I'm going to sing this song. Go. When a home won't sell and it's stuck on the property market, who are you going to call on UK TV style? Anne-Maurice, the house doctor, next. Thank you.